Hello, dear traders, and welcome back to Insta TV. You're watching Financial News with me, Anna Kasatkina. Today, the United Kingdom released rather strong economic data. Nevertheless, the pound versus the dollar pair has barely changed and stayed at low levels. The flash estimates showed that in the second quarter, the British economy expanded at a faster annual pace of 1.3%. On a quarterly basis, the UK's gross domestic product grew by 0.4%. This result came in line with analyst expectations. At the same time, the monthly pace of growth did not meet the forecast. In June, the GDP volume increased by just 0.1 percent, while experts predicted a rise of 0.2 percent. Additionally, the industrial production report came in line with the forecast. In June, the output in the United Kingdom increased by 0.4 percent on a monthly basis and by 1.1 percent in annual terms. What's more, the trade balance report exceeded market expectations, showing a smaller deficit. In June, the shortfall narrowed to £11 million. pounds. However, the future of trade relations between the United Kingdom and the European Union remains uncertain. This uncertainty puts the pound-dollar pair under pressure. The cable was trading below the level of 1.2800. Traders do not hurry to buy the British currency, as the next round of negotiations between Britain and the EU can bring unexpected results. Meanwhile, the euro-dollar pair plunged below the two-month low. The chart has approached the level of 1.1440 on the back of political instability in Turkey and a crash of the Turkish lira. Experts anticipate that the euro and the pound sterling will end this trading week in the negative zone. In addition to the mentioned factors, expectation of a strong inflation report from the US put the European currencies under pressure. And that is all for now. Thanks for watching and see you back soon.